Can you hear me? Yes, I can now. Hello. How are you? Hello, teacher. I am fine. How Hello, excellent. Yeah, I'm good, thank you. Um, sorry, I'm running a bit late. Um, I apologise for that, but hopefully we can get going now. Um, do you want to put your camera on if it works? And we'll get going. Brilliant. Okay, so can you introduce yourself? In my free time, I usually listen to music and uh, do housework. My favorite um, activity is badminton. Excellent. Well done, Rose. Okay, speaking task. So what are some similarities and differences between the photos? You should use phrases below in your the phrases below in your answer. For example, um, both photos show dot dot dot, and in the first photo I can see dot dot dot, but in the second photo dot dot dot. Okay. So um, if you want to have a go when you're ready. Um, in the first photo, I can see there. Uh, is Victory. Uh, but in the second photo, I think they lost. Excellent. Um, would you like to say anything else about the photos? Um, in picture one, people are really happy. But picture two is so sad. Brilliant. Um, so continuing to compare and contrast the photos, let's now think about these things. So how are the people feeling and why? So you've sort of already spoken a bit about this. Um, how are the sports different? What qualities do you need to succeed in the sports? And which of the sports would you prefer to do, if any, and why? Um, to do football because I can't quite hear you very very well Rose it's cutting out a bit perhaps the internet isn't uh, very good um I think um it's cutting out um Tab? maybe you could um move move somewhere else in the house have you got um good good signal there
you're on mute now. Um, maybe just could you try your answer again? Because I didn't quite hear it the first time. Sorry. Um, how are the spots different? Yeah, that's better. I can hear you better now. Um, the picture one, they cycling, and picture two, they play with a football. Brilliant. What qualities do you need to succeed in the sports? Um, I think uh, I need uh, like um. So, for example, I, um, you need to be hardworking or determined. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Let's move on to the next question. Uh, so, which of the sports would you prefer to do, if any, and why? Um, I prefer football because it is interesting, and I really like watch it in uh on the TV. Brilliant. Okay, listening task. Read sentences one to six. You're going to hear a conversation between a student who is looking for a flat in London and a lending agent. Choose the correct answers, A, B or C. I'm looking for a house or flat to rent. Okay, what exactly are you looking for? Well, I want somewhere for me and two friends to share. We're students at City University and we're going to be in London till the end of June. We need somewhere quite cheap. We can't afford to pay a lot of rent. I see. Are you interested in a furnished flat or have you got your own furniture? We want a furnished flat. Fine. Now, what parts of London are you interested in? Mm, I suppose central London is very expensive. Very. So, somewhere in north London is fine, and near a tube station if possible. Well, I think I've got just the thing for you and your friends. Oh. A three-bedroomed flat, furnished, not far from Finsbury Park tube station. The rent is £500 a week. Have a look at the photos. Oh, it looks great. There's a pub within walking distance and a post office just across the street. Oh, and there's an internet cafe nearby too. Ah, that's useful because I've got a computer at home. When can we go and see it? How about Friday at 10am? Does that suit you? Fine. Uh, where shall we meet? I'll give you the address and we can meet outside the house. Mm. What's the neighbourhood like? It's really nice and quiet. Oh, <laughs> did you say quiet? Yes. Is that a problem? Uh, well, yes, perhaps. You see, we love having parties and we like listening to music. One of my flatmates plays the electric guitar, so I don't think we'd be very popular with the neighbours and we don't want to cause problems. Couldn't you find something in a different neighbourhood? Somewhere exciting? Let me see. Well, what about this one? Three finished bedrooms in a big detached house. Oh. Four students are already renting rooms there. They're looking for three more students to rent the other three rooms. Mm. How much is the rent? Only £300 a week. £100 each. Sounds great. It's a lot of people in one house, but we need somewhere cheap. 
When can we have a look at it? I'll have to call and make an appointment. Could you phone me tomorrow and we'll fix a time? No problem. Thanks for your help. Okay, let's go through the answers. So, number one. Uh, it's so hard, but uh, number one is, I think, I. Very good. Number two. Uh, number two is B. Brilliant. Number three. Um, number three is uh, the university. Very good. Four. Mm, number four. I think I'm um, favorite in the neighborhood. Is that B? Yeah. Excellent. Number five. Um, number five, I think the rent is too high. Good. And number six. Number six is they are a really for students in the house. Good. Well done, Rose. Great job. And um, we've got. Uh, this is our last activity. It's a reading task. You've got to complete the text with the words below, so the words in red, um, and then read out the text, completing it with these words. So you just want a minute to think about it and then read it out when you're ready. You ready to give it a go? Um, uh, I think it's okay. Yeah? Yeah. Good luck. Okay. Um, when you're ready. I am a student at London University. I live in a flat with I near the So I live in a flat which I share with two yes, friends. I share with two friends. It isn't our old flat. We we ran it, but the flat isn't fur furnished. Yeah, furnish. So we are got our 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 furniture. The flat a uh, part of a uh, um your first yeah detached is it a uh, is it in a nice quiet flat
neighborhood. Neighborhood. And the bridesmaid are very nice and always say hello. Look, Kili, the super station. Mm. Is isn't too high, so we can't afford it. My two, my two, my two flat match are also at London University. So every morning we work together. We work together to the tagged to the tube station. Uh, to the tube station and take the underground into the city. Brilliant. Well done, Rose. That was really good. Um, big well done to you. And you're all finished now. So I hope you have enjoyed the rest of your evening and really enjoyed teaching you. Thank you, teacher. Have That's a good okay. day. Thank Goodbye. you. Bye.